All right, so all of you actually get a bonus video because this actually turns out to be a sphere fork, an actual sphere fork. All right, I'm going strictly off of the Elite Discord. Uh, something I haven't said in a while, right? Yeah, launches have been very dry. <laughs> all right, it's, it, it's like this everywhere. So, uh, so this is basically a sphere slash Titano style project and their code is forked off of sphere. Uh, I'm not really sure which version though, so I'm going to assume it's version 1 until maybe someone says otherwise. Because version 2 only came out like less than a week ago, so I don't think you can just fork that quickly. Now supposedly this sphere fork has a little extra functions, which hopefully they mentioned here in the front, so let's take a look. Um, so let's see. This takes me, where does this actually, where can you actually buy this? Because according to deck screener, this error message up on the upper right corner, uh, you know, get listed, uh, it says there's no decks. Let me see, just read it. Okay, so they have their own little thing here. Oh, okay. Well, well Titano does the same thing too. They have their, they have their own little decks. Uh... So they are 300% a year. So nice flat rewards. All right, very good. And actually, let me read the Elite Discord. Hal Jax might have something else to say. No problem, bro. Dev seems solid. Uh, hopefully they get some more momentum with a big marketing push. The innovation is there. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. All right. Uh, and this thing just launched, so they haven't rug pulled yet. Uh, okay, every 30 minutes, uh, you get the standard blah blah blah. Here's a breakdown of the rebase and tax distributions. Uh, okay. So pre sales whitelist is 20.41%, 204.1 million rebase tokens were sold. Okay. Well, at least they have a pretty nice looking website. Listing an LP has been locked for five years. Uh, well, I guess I would count as their marketing. Okay. Uh, and that's pretty much all that it says here. Well, that's really not much. Also, none of these actually link out to anywhere. So they haven't done their marketing push yet. Okay, great. So... Well, Halogenic said they do something different, but I don't see it listed here. They kind of need to say that. That's actually a big deal. Hmm. Well, for the most part, people really like Sphere, and maybe a lot of people might feel that it's too late to get into it. So, I don't know. I, mean, I don't like the idea of passing on this project. Especially because it's on Binance Smart Chain, so I do have reserve funds. Do I feel like gambling? That's the thing. You know what? I already have Sphere, so I'll probably let you guys and gals get into this. So, like, in a lot of what, because I got in on Sphere when it was 0 0.001 cents, right, in the whitelist. So right now the price is basically a little under double that. So very cheap, right? Uh, and obviously this project did just launch, but I don't really see anything here. So where is Where's the white paper? I mean, they, I mean, Carnahan, he said the devs were pretty solid, but even High Point had solid devs and they had trouble. All right, so they have a 15% buy tax, they have a 20% sell tax. Oh, before I go on, I actually am trying to research uh, crisis plus opportunity, the Chinese proverb thing. All I get on uh, Google uh, results is just people bashing it and say, oh, it's, it doesn't actually mean the context. It's like, <sighs> it's so frustrating because there's plenty of situations where people had bad situations and turned it around. Like, that's really what it is. And it's just frustrating reading, like, shit that's not related to that and people getting it wrong. Yeah. And then, and then people wonder why America's gone all the hell. Ugh. Oh, well. 
15 percent 20 percent uh okay so yes it is like sphere because they have the progressive tax system that sim and i designed oh okay so this really is a true <clears throat> i'm actually going to link to this particular page this is actually important because in order to be a sphere fork you have to have at least this thing huh so only th so this might actually i don't know would it work rebase swap as a service Okay, so they're actually doing um, okay to the wallet owner. So they're doing yeah. So they're doing a uh, quantum liquidity as a service too. I think uh, treasury reinvestments, uh, replace exclusive club. This is an NFT thing. This might actually be an okay project to actually go into. Yeah, so they definitely ripped off the sphere code. So I want to read what this actually is. And liquidity pools as a service. Uh, how to sign up for RAS. Yeah, I mean, this thing is not out yet. So this is going to be... I mean, Sim spent a lot of time getting this to work. So, I mean, it depends if these guys can figure out the same thing, too. Price per token. Uh, well, wait, what? No, that doesn't make sense because this is translated into USD price. Hmm. I don't know. Uh, in the last 24 hours, there have been 286 buys and 157 sells, which isn't really that many sells. Yeah, this is actually pretty cheap. Basically, this is. Right now, this is the 10% of the cost of Seer. Actually, it's 9%. So, it's definitely a lot cheaper. Hmm. Yeah, they also did the progressive uh, multiple rounds for the whitelist as well to give everybody a chance. Yeah, this is exactly... So, this really is a Sphere fork. Yeah, because remember, I was in the original whitelist, but this is exactly what we did. Again, I'm not going to tell you how much I put into the original Sphere whitelist. Um, let me see. Yeah, I mean, they really have to do marketing, and then they have to get the code. So, I don't know. Do I really want to hold this? I mean, it's the first It's the first project that I can see that is actually a seer fork. Because there's going to be a lot of people doing the same thing, too. Hmm. Well, then again, I kind of know from past experience that even despite Sim's best efforts, Sphere can still dump, right? We just went through it. Now it's recovering, thank God. And the other thing is, Sim really is on a completely different level. Hmm. I mean, I have to think. Think about all the people that copied Titano, right? Who do you know that copied Titano has succeeded? Only Seifu and Web3. Web3 has their own NFTs. And Seifu apparently is creating their own blockchain in June, I think. So that's a big reason why Seifu, I think, is still maintaining its price. But if they obviously don't launch the blockchain, Seifu is going straight to zero, you know, basically. Like every other, uh, you know, Titano-style project. But there's something unique being brought to the table. And then Sphere came along and basically did everything that Titano has refused to do. All right. And plus a lot more. So I could probably buy into this and do a short term play. But the simple fact that there's there's a very new project. There's, they haven't started their marketing. I mean, the Sphere code really is that good. But. Man, I really do not actually want to uh, pass on this project, but I think I'm going to. Even if this thing hits a penny, believe it or not. All right, believe it or not. Hmm. You know what? Maybe we should pop into. Our, maybe I should actually pop into our Discord. Let me actually. Yeah, let me actually. 
Uh, here's an article from Yahoo Finance in uh, the leaked Discord. Quite bullish getting posted on there too, I guess. They must have good industry links. You pay for those links. You pay for those links. Uh, doing the video live right now, and I was talking about their marketing. Oh. All right, let me actually go into their Discord. Uh, 88,943 members. That's actually a lot of people. Uh, I'm going to open Discord. So I want to see what this is. Uh, okay, I've already agreed and read the rules. All right, they have four core team members. I see three moderators. Okay. Um, React is there to verify yourself. Well, I verified myself, so. <sighs> Jesus Christ. All right. Uh, all right, there we go. So I'm in here. We have Mr. X. Uh, Mr. X, Mr. X, Mr. A. Mr. J is listed. So that's six developer people, supposedly. Mr. X, Mr. X, Mr. J. No, that's listed there. Mr. X, Mr. X. Okay. Uh, they bought a Market Watch article on April 28th. Yahoo Finance, Digital Journal. So I don't know why their links don't work on the front page. I guess that was an oversight. Mr. J, Mr. X. Okay, so I can I can definitely say there's like six developers. Well, supposedly developers. So you got the whitelist, whitelist rebase, blah, 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 blah. Okay. I see everyone copying that uh, monkey guy uh, NFT, funny enough. So this is actually a pretty difficult decision. Do I actually want to uh, actually buy into this project? This is actually pretty difficult, actually. <coughs> not really, but hopefully not too expensive. I mean, hopefully not too expensive. Let's see, there's a new announcement by some. We will uh, built by the best of multi family for the investor. You can be ready to generate treasury growth. Our new dashboard soon is clearly mark up in the attachments. Who else does that? How will other you make more money with the money I invest if they are putting money? My money to steal a car. I try to do it. So I had to consider what is their mission to you. Now that you know, I see you're not hold. Really, next year, we don't care who bailed on this. sign of there. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's the other thing too. Rebase does not have the partnerships that uh, Sphere can do. Yeah. Uh, I'm in there. I'm in there. Oh. Oh. I, just left. I don't know. I don't want to end this uh, video until I make a decision on whether I want to buy into this project or not. But I mean, the buy volume does look kind of slow too. Yeah. I might be making a mistake, but I'm probably going to pass on this. Kind of sucks, but I mean, this is a real sphere fork, though. Like, they actually uh, are you. This has to be using the version 1 code, though, so they got a lot of work to do. But I mean, there appears to be six developers uh, on Rebase, so they have a lot of work to do, especially since they would have to compete against Sim, which is. I mean. That's a t pretty tall order, all right? Even though, because I'm pretty sure Sim probably has other people helping him out too. Or, I don't know, maybe he really is coding everything himself. All I know is Sim is an actual grandmaster coder. So, you know, yeah. Happy they didn't kill the chart on day one. Yeah, they activate RF feed to do buyback in order to save it from going below four. Okay. Did they really do that? Okay, um, definitely pass. Okay, so apparently Rebase used the treasury to do a little bit of a buyback already. 
Okay. Well, in that case, yeah, I'm definitely going to pass then. Because when you have to actually buy back your token, instead of just developing, then that's actually a very bad sign. So that's too bad. That's too bad. Because this actually uh, seems pretty solid. But, I mean, we go by other projects. I mean, there, I don't really see anything different here on the front page. So... Uh, you could take a gamble uh, if you want to do uh, also the AP. Oh, that's the other thing, too. The APY is actually technically a lot higher than it should be, right? Because remember, Sims thing is to lower the APY to make the project sustainable. Oh, yeah, I completely forgot about this. Yeah. So this is definitely a pretty big gamble, but they obviously seem like the devs, I'm assuming they're actually six individual developers. They do seem pretty committed. So if you're willing to take that gamble and hope that they can, like, you know, work hard enough to, uh, you know, make this project sustainable, this could be a pretty decent play for uh, for a lot of you. Um, <clears throat> you know, and you don't even have to put in a lot because right now the price is extremely cheap too. And it looks like they just started their marketing. Well, I don't know they. I shouldn't say they just started the marketing push because. These articles were actually from last week, and for some reason, after one week, they did not update the links here. Uh, but they did link. They did update the links here. Okay, so media partners. Okay, so they actually put the links over on the right hand side. Okay, so yeah, digital use, Yahoo, Market Watch. So uh, let's do let's see Yahoo Finance. See, this is April twenty second, two thousand twenty two. So. Okay. All right. Well, we'll see how it goes. They do have an app. Um, yeah, I do have any... crap. All right. So I have to link to this too. So this is probably a fork of the uh, Sphere uh, version one uh, UI and stuff too. Uh, yes, they did rip off the cell tax uh, tier thing down here as well. So the RFE is 13 grand, our, uh, treasury, circling supply, yeah. That's it, 613 tokens burned. I mean, my stupid social icons in the lower left are uh, covering this, but how do I do this? No. Uh, I'm just a little groggy right now because I didn't expect to do another video, especially so soon. But yeah, that's the amount of burn tokens that you got. So, uh, they do not have the lottery. Do they have games? Do they have rebased games or Titano play? So they don't even have that yet. Oh boy. Okay, well they have a lot of work cut out for them. So I'm personally gonna pass, but this is a real sphere fork. So you wanna do a little bit of gambling? Well, I mean you could try this. Because again, right now, launches are pretty dry, but I think Big Cats is launching any second, so actually within bring it within 48 minutes, so, you know, people are probably going to be doing that instead. So, anyway, I'm definitely done for the day. I'll, po I'll make sure the YouTube description has all these links, and um, I don't know, I guess, I guess check out uh, Rebase. Uh, Rebase Finance, because they are using their own decks apparently already, so that's actually a pretty good sign. So, if they can onboard other people, uh, maybe that should work, right? But, yeah. Anyway, I don't want to badmouth this project, so. Um, so, okay. So, unless something else comes up, uh, I'll see you all later in the live... Oh, God, I just remembered. Yeah, I'm going to be live streaming later, so I'm going to be doing a lot of work today. So, maybe even though the weather's shitty, I should probably go for a walk. I, I've been cooped up in the in this place for like a short for like a few days, so I need some I need some air. Uh, all right, so I'll see you in a little bit. Uh, make sure you hit the like, follow, or subscribe button. I actually added the uh, subscribe button to my YouTube channel, so it should show up everywhere now. So I'm kind of curious to see if I get a lot of subscribers because of that. And if I do, I wonder how many I've lost because I didn't have that sub button there. So, like, when you mouse over the video, right, on the lower right corner, it says, you know, I, I just chose a standard subscribe button, so I don't know what it looks like, but I know it looks good, so. So, yeah, so, yeah, so thank you again to all the new people and old people watching this video, and uh, I'll see you in a little bit, and uh, check out Rebase Finance, an actual sphere for it, all right?
Thanks.